Hello everybody, welcome back here. I thought I'd do another video on kind of Game Pass Cloud Gaming, uh, the Xbox Cloud. I, I don't even know what to call it anymore. But this time we're gonna be checking it out the mobile version. Here we have an S7 and we're running it on Wi-Fi 6. I don't know if you can see it there, which is gonna be the fastest kind of you get. Of course, if you really care, you can get a USB to ethernet and plug it in, jack it in right there. We also have an Xbox, uh, Series controller. That's the, um, the, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, Starfield controller. Jesus. So let's check out some games. Um, let's, let's just check out Battlefield. What is it? What is this? Oh, that's my, that's my lights. There we go. Okay. Let's see how can I get like it? I wanna, I wanna like see if I can figure like get zoom in and all that stuff. Okay, we'll dismiss. Okay, we'll do um, conquest, um, join a conquest, and then see how fast we can die. Image quality looks pretty good. Again, in my previous video, um, I did look at like, hey, it's kind of 720p running on a Series S. Uh, as long as you have the bandwidth, this should be good to go. Spirit. There we go. And this is a S7 or S8 tab which is their high-end tablet. I mean, realistically, any tablet should work because it is just video compression. Okay. Mm. Wow, it's actually really responsive. Yeah, there we go. We'll do it like this. And then the, the test. Man, that's crazy. This is, they, they really improved it over, over some time because I remember this not being a good experience. Um, like, I would say a couple years ago. Oh, here's somebody. Oh my God, I just killed that guy on the tablet. Um, while kind of looking like, hey, should I do a video on PlayStation Premium? They don't have a mobile version. Um, though you can stream your your you can stream your PlayStation Four or Five games to your mobile device, but you can't really. Is that a bot? Oh, it is a bot. <laughs> Sweet. This is a bot too. Oh my god. You know what? I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. No, that's a friendly. Like, is this an optimal kind of way to play this game? Not really. But, like, hey, if you had, like, a pretty big tablet or something and a controller, like, and a fast internet. But the thing is, is that um, hotel internet is not fast. Um, I think I'm going to do a video. I wonder if I should bring this this uh, this stuff. I, I guess I could do it on my, my laptop. Let's see if anybody's coming to me. Oh, this AI is coming to me. Let's turn up the audio. There we go. We just took control of Delta Sector. Is under attack. Stay safe, squad. Like it is a little bit on the, the grainy Our side. We hold more sectors than our enemy. We're, we're coming back. We'll keep on playing until I die. Take what you need. 
Oh my god, I really need to reload. Now how do I get out of here? Do I just like hit back? Oh no, here it is. And we just hit quit. Yes, quit. Cool. That was actually kind of cool. That was really cool. That was really cool. And let's do uh, Forza. Yes. Come on. Be a little bit too loud. Here we go. Let me see if I can get a fast lap here. Let's do a um, let's do a rival. Okay. Again, just to prove that this is the the Series S version. If you go to video, uh, you will notice that it's only visuals and performance. The Series X version has performance RT. So we'll do race, rivals. Let's go A, N, Brands Hatch, Cirque. Um, I already got Suzuka. Let's do Hokana. Not a lot of tracks here. My Stradia. Like, it's... Yeah, mm, not criticizing this game. Not gonna criticize this game. Like... Okay, we'll do a cold lap and a hot lap. Oh, Jesus. 16 minutes. I do have it on automatic. But still looks pretty good. Yeah, this is like really responsive. I'm like impressed. I'm like really impressed. Oh, Jesus. R really responsive as I like botched that. I came too fast. Okay. Still gonna do a hot lap. We're not seeing any, um, like artifacting too. When I was playing it on uh, on the console, there was like would be like a banding problem. Not bad. It's smooth. Like you could even see that this is sixty FPS, pretty smooth. Oh my god, I am just fucking up this. This is me just being bad. Let's go a little bit higher so I can see, I can see the road a little bit better. Hot lap. Come on. Now, I do have to preface, I, I should have started this at the top, but like, I live in Hawaii and um, it is, you know, I got 700 down, 40 up, so. I feel like this would be a perfect example of latency more than anything else, because my latency to these servers is probably like 90, and it's this is pretty good. You're not going to make some like insane hot times on, on this.
But that's the thing that, like, kind of elevates kind of the Game Pass cloud gaming is that, like, hey, they have a sh- rich mobile uh, kind of environment, too. Like, you can just play some of these games just without a controller, which is kind of crazy. Cool. We're done with that. Yes. Now, I, I, I guess I sh- the next one I should do, which would be pretty cool, is... Um, okay, let's quit this, quit this. No! No, no, we're just going to do that, do that, do that. Quit. Yes. It's fine. The next game... Oh, no, no, go away. Let's see here. So, yeah, there's um, Play With Touch, like Vampire Survivors. Puts up a, you know, like a little... On screen HUD. Go to all. Just go down all the way to the bottom. Two. Oh wow! I wonder how High Fly rushes. Um, where is? Is this sorted by name? Jesus. No. God, there's a lot of games here that. Are, uh, here we go. There we go. Boom. There we go. I feel like Flight Simulator is the perfect example of a game that should, like, hey, um, this game is, you know, terabytes and terabytes of data. And, but the problem is that this version sucks. I wonder if they will ever fix this in the 24, uh, uh, 2024. Um, wait, what was that? What was that? Oh, shit, there's a, there's a mouse right there. Oh, my God, I didn't even realize that this had mouse... Uh, this had that s- support. That's cool. Um, more options. Can we hide that? Gyroscopes. Cool. Okay. That's really cool. God, 40 years of flight simulator. Jesus. Let's see. And this is the problem. This is, like, the big problem, too. Um, is that, like, hey, yo... <laughs> It still needs the update because it has its own internal updater. Um, but man, I'm I'm really impressed by this. I'm actually really kind of impressed. Oh, did it did it seize up? Yeah, it's, that's hilarious. Did the app crash? No, the app. No. Nope. nope, the app didn't crash. It's just that crashed. Um, but anyways, we're gonna keep this short since it is mobile and running on my phone. Uh, but yeah, this is actually kind of impressive on mobile. Um, it would be cool to get some free-to-play games. I know the browser version has Fortnite, but like Destiny would be pretty cool. Apex would be really cool too. Say so like, hey, you're at a hotel Wi-Fi and you want to play some Apex on your phone because like, Apex mobile kind of like came and went real fast. Uh, but anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.